on this day last year, the 23rd of August, India made history by landing one of its missions and becoming for the first in the world to have landed on the south pole of moon, the Chandrayaan-3. And uh, all of us, of course, watched it, and Prime Minister joined us from his overseas trip, congratulated the scientists, and then also made the announcement that this day will be commemorated every year as National Space Day. And this uh, significantly happens to be the first National Space Day being observed by us. And therefore, we wish to do it in a manner that is befitting of the occasion. And I would rather say that not only a day of celebration, it's also a day of reflection and retrospection, and also of a roadmap charting for the future. So we have also tried to formulate the program accordingly, given it uh, an academic outlook with a futuristic vision. And as was being said by Dr. Shantanu, it's also an occasion to make the citizens aware, the youngsters particularly aware of the achievements done in the space sector in the last few years. And uh, somehow, or rather I would go to the extent of saying that because of the successful landing of Chandrayaan, it's not only the interest in space which has generated all across the country, suddenly there's a huge amount of interest in science, technology, innovation, startup across the uh, sectors.